In response to a creator who claimed that her Bell's palsy was caused by the Medicube booster device, Medicube has released a statement to deny this. Let's discuss the science. Facial paralysis can be caused by damage to the facial nerve, like with trauma, infection, and inflammation. When the cause cannot be found, the diagnosis is called Bell's palsy. Medicube says the electrical stimulation from its device is at a much lower current than other devices in the market. And it also goes on to say that electrical stimulation is used to treat Bell's palsy. Now, this is true. However, electrical stimulation can also cause side effects to nerves. And currently, there isn't a known safety limit for electrical stimulation devices. For weakness on one side of the face, the facial nerve has to be affected before it divides into its five main branches in the parotid salivary gland. Can the electrical stimulation from this device reach this deep and far back? I'm not sure, but I doubt it. The likelihood of nerve injury is probably low with this device, and I would not say it's impossible without more information from the brand and the patient.